All right, guys. Um, I want to show you all something I thought was interesting. Uh, I got the um, the snorkel on. I'll go over that. And um, I got I made a roof, windshield, um, cargo uh, racks, uh, and I put some good insulation on the back. But uh, I wanted to show you all something because they BRP it didn't come with any instructions. So if you want instructions, you have to go on their website and uh, you just type in the manufacturer number and uh, it'll pop up. <clears throat> and it's something I wanted to show you all that's really interesting is, um, I'll get to it right here. Yeah, see it, it highlights what to do with the fuel lines um, to add the fuel lines, um, take the um, tubes off, the air intake, move that, rewire it. Oh, this right here. If you're doing, this is important, if you're doing the intake, don't put both the rivets in, okay? Only put this end one on because the third CVT intake goes in right there and that's where I messed up because right here it tells me to assemble and put both rivets in oh and this is the one I want to show you when you buy these things new they're underneath the drive shaft of the motor is a vent tube about this big um, see if I can find it I put it somewhere Here it is. That's how big the vent tube is. That big. And it's hanging down off the water pump right there. So when you buy these things new, don't, I, I'm, I'm guessing, do not submerge them in the water. You gotta run the vent tube up high. See, I ran all mine up, up to the roof. I got those wrapped around the snorkel but real important I don't know if it causes damage but they told me if I'm snorkeling it run this thing up up high so that's kind of that's kind of ridiculous but I'm just letting you guys know ahead of time that's that's what it is but this is a really good website to uh, install any anything you buy from BRP so and uh, these are some of the best install instructions I've seen so there you go see how they mount those three CVTs up and that third one that third one right there if you put that rivet in there it's just you know I like my shit real sturdy so but uh, enough with this onto the uh, install um, one of the things I suggest is uh, I bought this stuff called Thermotech here I'll show you over here job dog alright Thermotech cool it Acoustical and heat control products. This shit right here is amazing. Let's throw it out here for you. It's thick, it's 70 millimeter thick, and on the other side it wraps off and it's like this sticky tar. See, it sticks to my finger. And it just wraps out everything on the plastics. And you put that on the back, and this sheet right here was 50 bucks on uh, Amazon, so you can just look that up. Um, it's more expensive at Summit, but um, I'll show you all here in a sec. Okay. 
trying to get some good lighting in here, but I took this whole back rack off and I use and I just wrap the whole back in in that Thermotech. And uh, there's the snorkels down there. I made sure everything was tight. But it turned out pretty darn good. It looks freaking sweet. Real good design. That's basically the CVT exhaust right there. But if you go in the water, you can see there's a little tiny hole right there. So if that side submerged in water, it comes up here, and then the air can still come out there and push the water down. So, pretty cool. But yeah, I wrapped this whole bag thing, and I would highly suggest doing it because, you know, if you can't in, the thing's going to get hot. So, over here. These are the uh, cargo racks I installed. It's pretty easy, you just need a rivet gun. It comes with six rivets. Pretty solid. Something to hang on to. The motor's pretty easy to get to. I said screw it, I just went ahead and got this toolbox. There's only 60, 70 bucks on Amazon, so. But the roof. I made the roof. I had some uh, diamond plate laying around. So. Hey, all it is to protect the sun and the water. That's all it is. But uh, right now I'm doing the winch. I'm in the middle of hooking up this 5,000 pound Badland winch on sale Harbor Freight with the coupon is $139.99 with a, with a two year warranty. And what's good about BRP is they have built in winch connections right there and right there for lights, light bars, winches. And everything so that's them in the middle of hooking up right now but uh yeah definitely need the winch i've got to put the winch on that but i decided to put on here because this is this is going to be the tank i'm gonna do a get all crazy with this thing and my wife's gonna be driving this and uh she come pull me out but uh i just want to show you all that real quick um on 2019 defender that uh, vent tube for the air uh, water pump. Uh, that thing's only, like I said, it's only, as you can see, four inches long. So I wouldn't trust that. But uh, yeah, you can see it's getting dirty. I've been riding around. It's been raining every day, so uh, getting it done. But. Hope you like it. All oh, the window, yeah, I cut cut some holes out in there with the uh, hole saw. Get some airflow in there. Got to have a windshield. Uh, I did the same thing with that one too. No time to see, but all right, y'all. I'll keep y'all updated. Uh, that's what I got for now. I don't think I'm gonna do much else to it, but uh, we're gonna test it out today.